Hi guys, today we're going to have a quick electromagnetic uh, quiz. So this is based on the electromagnetic spectrum. Uh, 12 quick questions, so grab a pen and a piece of paper and let's see how much you know. Okay, here comes the first question. What is the unit of speed? Number one, what is the unit of speed? Question number two. Do higher frequency electromagnetic waves have more or less energy than low frequency electromagnetic waves? So question number two, do higher frequency electromagnetic waves have more or less energy than low frequency electromagnetic waves? Question number three, what group in the electromagnetic spectrum has the lowest frequency? What group in the electromagnetic spectrum has the lowest frequency? Question number four. What is the unit of wavelength? What is the unit of wavelength? Question number five. What group in the spectrum has the longest wavelength? What group in the spectrum has the longest wavelength? Question number six. What group is situated between infrared and UV? What group is situated between infrared and ultraviolet? Question number seven. What is the unit of frequency? What is the unit of frequency? Question number eight. Do gamma rays have the shortest or longest wavelengths? Do gamma rays have the shortest or longest wavelengths? Question number nine. What ray is used to image the bones in your body? What ray is used to image the bones in your body? Question number 10. What group of the spectrum is between radio waves and infrared? What group of the spectrum is between radio waves and infrared? Question number 11. What equation links speed, frequency and wavelength? What equation links speed, frequency and wavelength? Question number 12. What part of the electromagnetic spectrum do we use to communicate with satellites? What part of the electromagnetic spectrum do we use to communicate with satellites? Here are your answers. Meters per second, more, radio waves, meters, radio waves, visible light, hertz, shortest, x-ray, microwaves, speed equals frequency times wavelength, and finally, microwaves.